Hello, it's Thursday, December 1st, and I'm Natalie Woods with your Maxi Forex Daily News. The U.S. dollar fell versus most of the other majors after six central banks led by the Federal Reserve made it cheaper for banks to borrow dollars in emergencies in a global effort to ease Europe's sovereign debt crisis. Wall Street ended on a positive note as the Nasdaq jumped by 4.17 percent and the Dow Jones gained by 4.24 percent. Crude oil rose by 97 cents, closing at $100.38 a barrel. Gold increased by 30% and finished at $1,746 an ounce. The crude oil inventories came out 3.9 million higher than expected. The euro increased versus the U.S. dollar as the central banks cut the cost of borrowing dollars yesterday. The pair is facing a resistance at 1.3520 on the two-hour chart. If this resistance breaks, the rate could reach 1.3600 until Friday. Overall, the euro dollar traded with a low of 1.3258 and with a high of 1.3532. The euro dollar last traded at 1.3452. The British pound gained versus the US dollar. As long as the pound dollar is trading above the 1.5680 level, the British pound remains bullish. If the pair breaks down below the support level at 1.5680, we'll probably see the pair declining towards 1.5600. Overall, the pound dollar traded with a low of 1.5527 and with a high of 1.5779. The pound dollar last traded at 1.5694. The yen rose versus the U.S. dollar as the U.S. dollar weakened against most of the currencies. The dollar Japanese yen's trend became negative after breaking the 77.50 level. As long as the pair is trading above this level, the U.S. dollar continues to be bullish. Overall, the U.S. dollar Japanese yen traded with a low of 77.28 and with a high of 77.14. The U.S. dollar Japanese yen last traded at 77.67. The Canadian currency rose the most since May 2010 as central banks reduced the cost of emergency dollar funding to ease Europe's sovereign debt crisis, buying riskier assets. As long as the pair is trading above the 1.01 level, the U.S. dollar's momentum is still positive. The next resistance level on the one-hour chart is located at 1.0220, and breaking this level will probably cause the pair to rise towards 1.0300. Overall, the U.S. dollar CAD traded with a low of 1.0122 and with a high of 1.0326. The U.S. dollar CAD last traded at 1.0187. Thank you for joining us today. For more information, please visit us at maxiforex.ru for all your online trading needs. I'm Natalie Woods, wishing you a happy trading.